first four years in federal prison for the biggest fraud case in the city of Jacksonville's history. And tonight we are hearing from some of the people at the heart of this case. Now that the ex CEO of JEA is headed to federal prison for his scheme in 2019, JEA union members past and present talk with us about their thoughts on the sentence and what it was like fearing in 2019 that hundreds of them could lose their jobs. On your side's Renata Di Gregorio joins us live now from the federal courthouse where ex CEO Aaron Zahn was sentenced. So Renata, what are you hearing? GD, during his trial and his sentencing, ex CEO Aaron Zahn was described as using JEA workers as pawns in his plan. One of his proposals involved laying off nearly 30% of the workforce. Well, now we are speaking to those people who are now watching Zahn go to prison. He knew what he was doing. Former and current JEA union leaders Raymond Olin Jr. and Ronnie Burris say there are still impacts from the scandal that became known as Jacksonville's largest fraud case. Ex-JEA CEO Aaron Zahn will spend four years in federal prison for crafting a scheme in 2019 to steal millions from the city of Jacksonville. I think he deserved more. Burris says Zahn made JEA workers fear they would lose their jobs. A lot of the, my members I've known since they were six, seven years old. So they're family to me. To know that I was negotiating a contract that was going to make them lose their job was concerning and it was, it was difficult. They were lying through their teeth and they were being disrespectful. To, if you ask me, you treated me like I'm an imbecile, you know, an idiot. Nah, I'm not. Olin says unions were prepared to fight. He knew what he was doing. He was going to get paid and big money. You know what I mean? So that to me shows greed. It brings anger because they're abusing you and they're trying to blindfold the city. Though Zahn may be away in prison, these men say Jacksonville will not forget the man they say backstabbed their city. What they can't do is erase this from their memory. You were going to take their livelihoods away. 